Hi there, welcome to Parent Information Night. My name is Melissa Gaffney. I'm a sixth grade language arts and social studies teacher, and I wanted to walk you through what we cover in sixth grade language arts and social studies. So with language arts, we cover all the major modes of reading and writing. Uh, first, we will grow as narrative writers. Uh, we talk a lot about the elements of a story, the importance of language and writer's craft, and how students can develop their own unique writer's voice. We will also grow as argumentative writers um, by learning how to form a claim, how to back it up with text-based evidence, and how to explain their evidence to further prove their argument. Um, students will also grow as researchers um, by developing a thesis, um, using high quality sources and talking about how do we vet those sources in order to better explain a topic of their choice. Um, throughout each of these writing units, we do work on things like spelling, grammar, vocabulary, organization of um, their writing, and then of course they'll grow as readers. Um, we do a lot of independent reading throughout the year, and then we also do whole class reads of novels and short stories, poetry. Um, so that is just a little bit of a taste of what language arts in sixth grade is like. Uh, we try to keep most work uh, done in class, but sometimes we run out of time, and um, in order to kind of make sure that uh, we can move at a good pace. Um, sometimes there will be homework at the end of days, maybe not every day, but um, so about 15 to 20 minutes might just be left over um, for students to kind of finish up things they start in class. For social studies, sixth graders in the entire state of Washington, so we're, we're no exception here, we study ancient civilizations. Um, we use a uh, World Civilization book that is published by Cengage uh, in cooperation with National Geographic. Um, and it is a great book that we have copies in um, the room and also as an online companion so students can access the text at any time via Schoology. Um, what we focus on with ancient civilization is not just learning about these amazing cultures in Mesopotamia, Egypt, India, China, Greece, Rome, um, but we also kind of connect those civilizations. How do they impact us today? Um, how can we use the skills of a historian? How do we read primary sources in order to understand more about ancient life and how these trends and things that we can look at thousands of years ago, how they continue to impact um, our world today. Um, and just like language arts typically not a ton of extra homework assigned, but sometimes students may be finishing up work that was assigned in class. So about 15 to 20 minutes of homework every day there as well. And that's a little bit of what language arts and social studies looks like in sixth grade.